All right, good morning, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube. Um, just wanted to pull this one out. I, it, this one actually got finished last night, um, but it wasn't quite done, you know what I mean? That was the deal. And so I put it back in, and just like real plastic, it has um, its failure steam. And when I took the mold off, it allowed this side to, um, like, puff. Their steam delaminated the, the plastic layers. Um, like right there, you can see it. Good flexibility. I mean, it's all that, and it's solid, and, and it's it's not. Um, it's actually a good quality. the The bass fiber helped out really nice as far as um, is its structural strength. I'll try not to move it so fast. Um, the it did actually really well. There's another way to do this too, and that would be with um, with ammonium, and you could actually use the pectin and the the more woody fiber of the plant um, to make this. Is that what it is? Is I made this same basic concoction, but with the uh, with um, with just the the flower of the plant and the and the woody the woody part. Um, that's what I'm saying. Oh, I just broke that. Oh, it's real thin. Yeah, crunchy. Okay, um, otherwise it's, it's durable. I mean, except there. <laughs> it was a brown spot or whatever you want to call it where it got overbaked. Um, but where it's, where it's not like that, you know what I'm saying? It's actually durable, durable. So, but, um. Well, there you go, guys, and we're not done. I got the next one in, and we'll see what that is. I put a little bit of weight on there so it can't delaminate, or I'm going to pray it can't delaminate, um, hopefully, wishfully think kind of thing, but let's see if I can't get that profile in there. Um, but like I said, Steam does nasty numbers on real plastic just as well. As, um, that's just one Achilles heel. The... The mold pressure, you know, the, the force between, the hydraulic force between the metal molds, um, that's kind of critical in plastic. In, in here, I'm just dealing with two little glass plates and with no real mold weight is what I'm saying, or mold pressure. So that did actually pretty well. In a metal mold, that would have done extremely well. With no burns, it would have been perfect is what I'm trying to say. Okay, guys, talk to you then.